असलम ग्रेट टू टुडे आर टॉपिक इज प्लेस वैल्यू बुक पेज नंबर सिक्सटीन हाउ वी कैन रीड अ बिग नंबर वी कैन गिव वी कैन रीड अ बिग नंबर बाई गिविंग दैम प्लेस वैल्यूज दिस इज अ नंबर टू फोर एट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल राइट देयर प्लेस वैल्यूज फ्रॉम राइट टू लेफ्ट दिस इज वंस टेंस एंड देन हंड्रेड In this number, two has place value of hundreds, four has place values of tens, and eight has place values of ones. So now we can read this easily. Two hundred and forty-eight. This number is two hundred and forty-eight. Other number is seven five four. We will write place values four five seven. This number is. Seven hundred fifty-four, seven hundred and fifty-four, or seven hundred fifty-four. Other number is three hundred and seven, seven zero three. This is three hundred and seven. Next number is three five eight. This is eight hundred and fifty-three. This is two five six. This number has. Six hundreds, five tens, and two ones. So this is six hundred and fifty-two. Three hundred and forty-one. Three hundreds, four tens, and ones. One ones. So this number is three hundred and forty-one. In your book, page number sixteen, there is a number. Two hundred and thirty-four. Four has ones place value, three has tens, and two has hundreds. This is the standard form of this number is two hundred and thirty-four. How we write the number in expanded form? For example, this is two hundred and thirty-four. How we can write this in expanded form? This is ones, tens, hundreds. Its expanded form is two hundred plus. Three tens plus four units or four ones. This is two hundred and thirty-four. When we add these numbers, they becomes this number, two hundred and thirty-four. This is expanded form of this number, two hundreds plus three tens plus four ones. This is two hundred and thirty-four. Now you can easily read a number and give it its expanded form. Here is exercise number one. Fill in the blanks. First question is four hundreds, five tens, and seven ones. Expanded form is four hundred plus fifty plus seven. This is four hundred and fifty-seven. Now we fill these other questions. Nine hundreds, so it becomes nine hundred. Nine tens mean ninety. Plus two ones mean two, so this is oh sorry, six hundred. This is six hundred. This is six hundred ninety plus two, so this is six hundred and ninety-two. The numbers become six hundred and ninety-two. In third question, they have given us the standard form of a number, and we have to write this number in expanded form and in words. This is. Eight hundred and seventy-five. So we write eight hundreds, seven tens, and five ones. Eight hundred, seven tens means seventy plus five. So it becomes eight hundred and seventy-five. Question number four is six hundreds plus nine tens. This is six hundreds plus nine tens mean ninety, and in there is no value for one, so we write zero here. When we add these three numbers, it becomes six hundred and ninety. Okay, for example, six hundred plus ninety plus zero. When we add these three numbers, zero, nine plus zero, nine, and six, it becomes six hundred and ninety. The last question is three hundreds 
we write 300 there plus 3 tenths it becomes 30 and 3 ones 3 when we add three, three, these three numbers it becomes 330 so it is very easy to read a big number and give write its expanded form I hope you understand and you can now solve exercise number one easily. Jazakallah.